hello dear students welcome back to my channel in this video we'll see key answers for uh, 8th standard model paper released by KSEAB that is Karnataka School Examination and Assessment Board uh, you know that this time for class 5 and class 8 we have public exam they have released the model paper in this video we will see the key answers or the model answers for the model paper so the total marks is for 40 marks time is 2 hours this is how your exam paper will be looking like you will mention the you will write the name then students, SATS number, signature of the students, school dice code, school name, cluster, block, district, this and all will be filled by the room, invisible letter. Then the teacher who is valuing the paper will write the marks here, what are the marks you have obtained. Now the first main is multiple choice questions, 20 multiple choice questions will be there. The first question, the cube root of 125 is 5 into 5 into 5 is what 125 therefore the cube root of 125 is 5 therefore the correct answer is option a if a is a non-zero integer m and n are the natural integers then m is greater than n then a by m a power m by a power n equals is what a power m minus n therefore the correct answer is option a the digit in unit place of uh, cube of 27 the unit digit of 27 is 7 now 7 cube is 343 therefore the unit digit of cube of 7 is 3 therefore the cube of 27 will also be 3 therefore the correct answer is option D the shape of the solid in the given figure is it's a cone therefore the current answer is option C cone here the water the box provided you will write the alphabet of the correct answer and also you will write the answer alphabet with answer the formula to find out the curved surface area of cylinder is 2 pi rh square units the least number to be multiplied to 243 to make it perfect cube by factorizing we get 243 equals 3 cube into 3 square so I should multiply with 3 therefore it becomes 3 cube into 3 cube therefore it becomes a perfect cube therefore the correct answer is option D the length and the length breadth and height of a cubical room are 12 8 and 4 centimeter respectively then the area of its four walls we need to find out the the lateral surface of cube that is 2h into l plus b h is 4 l is 12 breadth is 8 by simplifying we get 160 square meters therefore the correct answer is option c dear students uh, do subscribe the channel and also do join the telegram group which is provided in the description the perfect cube 729 lies between the cube of these numbers 9 9 cube is 729 therefore it lies between 8 cube and 10 cube therefore the correct answer is option b the central angle of the sector representing one third of the region in a pie chart so one third the total angle is what 360 one third of 360 is what 120 degree therefore the correct answer is option c diameter of cylinder is equal to height of the cylinder we know that the, the total surface area is what 2 pi r r plus h here h equals 2 r because height is equal to diameter diameter equals what 2 times the radius right now replace h by 2 r 2 pi r into 2 r plus r that is 2 r plus r e equals 3 r 3 to the 6 pi as it is r into r r square therefore it is 6 pi r square correct answer is option b 4 cube can be expressed with base 2 as what 4 cube can be written as 2 square into 3 that is 2 power 6 therefore the correct answer is option D 12th question 
Taking 4 cube as common factor and simplifying, we get the quotient as 192. Height and radius of a cylindrical, cylindrical shaped water storage tank are 3 meters and 7 meters respectively. The cost of painting its curved surface at the rate of 5. We should find out the CSA of cylinder. What we get is 132. Now 132 into 5 is what? 660. Therefore, the correct answer is 660. The general form of 1 into 1000 into 4 into 100 plus 2 into 1 plus 3 by 100 plus 2 by 1000 is option D. 1402.032 units tens is missing therefore it is zero hundreds next thousands three by hundred is point three three by ten it's missing a number is missing here a decimal number is missing here therefore it is zero three cubes each of edges 4 cm are placed one adjacent to each other to form a cubot. So the length becomes 12 cm, that is 4 plus 4 plus 4. It becomes the length is 12 cm. Now the height, length and height will be same, that is 4 cm and 4 cm. The graph that represents the relationship between whole of a circle and its parts is pie chart. The multiplicative inverse of 10 power minus 5 is, it is option D, 10 power. If you multiply, you should get the multiplicative identity. So, 10 power minus 5 into 10 power 5. What we get is 10 power 0, which is equal to 1, which is a multiplicative identity. Therefore, the correct answer is option D. The expanded form of uh, 2x plus 3y whole square is a square plus b square plus 2ab, that is a square plus b square plus 2ab that is the correct answer is option b anything to the power of 0 is 1 therefore the value of this to the power 0 is 1 therefore the correct answer is option b the monthly salary of a person is 50,000 the amount spent on various activities is shown in the pie chart the amount saved by the person is it is 3,000 why 6% that is 6 by 6% 6 of 50,000 is 3,000 therefore the correct answer is option A write in two properties of rhombus or question name the point of intersection of vertical axis and horizontal axis in a Cartesian plane the properties of rhombus all sides of a rhombus are equal opposite sides of a rhombus are parallel diagonal bisect each other at right angles any two properties is enough the point of intersection of vertical axis and horizontal axis is origin. The coordinates of origin are 0, 0. Construct a square of side 6 cm. First draw a length of 6 cm, line segment of 6 cm. Then draw the perpendicular line that is 90 degree. Then cut an arc of 6 cm on both sides. Then join this. You will get a square of side 6 cm. Locate and join the points A of 1 comma 1, B of 1 comma 3, C of 3 comma 3 and D of 3 comma 1. So on the x-axis and y-axis what we get is 1 comma 1 is here, B is 1 comma 3, C and D. 4 is added to 8 times a number, we get 60. Let the required number be x. 8 times x plus 4 equals 60. 8x equals 60 minus 4. 8x equals 56. x equals 56 by 8. x equals 7. If the weight of uh, 12 sheets of a thick paper is 40 grams, weight of one sheet, let, as, let us assume the weight of one sheet as x. Therefore, 12 times one sheet equals what? 40. x equals 40 by 12. Weight of one sheet is for 10 by 3 grams. Now total weight is what? 2 and half kg converted into grams. It will get 2500 grams. Now number of sheet equals total weight by the weight of each sheet. That is 2500 by 10 by 3. It becomes 2500 into 3 by 10. We get number of sheets equals 750. The base of a swimming pool in front of a girl's house is uh, is quadrilateral in the shape 
if 60 degree 120 degree and 70 degree are the measures of the angles of this quadrilateral then find the measure of remaining angle uh, the sum of angles in a quadrilateral is 360 angle a plus angle b plus angle d plus equals 360 angle a is 60 degree angle b is 120 angle c is 70 we should find out angle d now d equals 360 minus 250 we get the remaining angle as 110 now verifying Euler's formula thus for this prism f plus v equals e plus 2 number of faces is 5 number of vertices is also 5 1 1 2 3 4 5 so number of edges is 8 so 5 plus 5 equals 10 8 plus 2 is 10 hence Euler formula is verified find any two rational numbers between 1 by 4 and 5 by 3 take make the denominator same it will be easy for you so between these these two numbers fractions are making the um, denominator same so that uh, you can write any rational number between those two numbers so it, uh, I have chosen 4 by 12 and 10 by 12 on a Sunday 8 845 people went to the zoo how many people went to the zoo on Sunday 845 on Monday only 169 went on Monday how many people went to the zoo 169 what is the decrease in number how many people have not went to the zoo on Monday that is 845 minus 169 we get 676 decrease in percentage is 676 by 845 into 100 we get 80 percentage verify associative property for addition associative property of addition is what a plus b plus c equals a plus b plus c now substituting and simplifying we get 8 by 3 which is equal to 8 by 3 hence verified if a person calculates compound interest on rupees 10,000 for 2 interest uh, 2 years at 10 percent per annum what is the compound interest principal amount is 10,000 time is 2 years rate of interest 10 percent amount equals what P plus 1 plus R by 100 whole to the power T time is 2 uh, rate of interest 10 what we get is 10 ones are 10 tens are taking LCM what we get is 11 by 10 whole square 11 square is 121 10 square is 100 what we get is 12,100 now compound interest equals amount minus principal what we get is 2,100 is the compound interest now drawing pie chart uh, for 3 marks now total 18 by 36 into the cent total central angle 9 by 36 into 360 6 by 36 into 360 3 by 36 into 360 we get this angle by using the protector and the ruler we can draw this very easily the total mark scored by 40 students in mathematics is as follows draw histogram for given data so 0 to 10 is 7 0 10 to 20 is uh, 9 20 to 30 is 8 30 to 40 is 10 40 to 50 is 6 right age of uh, I age of a is 5 times more than 5 more than the 3 times the b is condition 1 the age of a is 5 more than the 3 times the age next the condition is they have given directly age of uh, the present age of a is what 44 years then the age find the present age of b so it's a direct condition substitute the value of uh, equation 2 in 1 what we get is 44 equals 3b plus 5 now age of b is what 13 years On second question divide 44 x power 4 minus 5 x square minus 5 x cube minus 24 x square by 11 x x minus 8 11 and 11 for the water gate is 4 x taking x square common x and x will cancel out what you get x square minus 5 x minus 24 by x by 8 factor is x square minus 5 x minus 24 what you get is x plus 3 x minus 8 substituting here x minus 8 x minus will cancel what you get is 4 x into x plus 3 dear students do try to subscribe the channel and also do join the telegram group all the best for the uh, exams do practice well don't uh, fear for the exam 
prepare well and hope you attempt all the question attempting all the questions is very important this is a just the evaluation examination whatever you have learned that will be tested don't worry don't fear about the exam especially for 8 standard students and 5th standard students this is just a test for evaluation this is normal exam as you write in the school nothing to worry much do well all the best